Greetings, this is Gintian, and today we are playing on the Veil using Minecraft 1.20.1. I need to make more room for my base here under the mountain, and I did that, but then something strange happened. Let me show you what I mean. Would you like to play a game? That's what it says. This appeared out of nowhere. I didn't put it here, but there is a button. And sometimes I just have to press the button. Where am I? Hey, a door. Let's just go through it. I'll press the button and walk in. Please note I did not put anything in the ender chest or read the instruction book. Also note that there is a pressure plate right in front of the door and as I walk across these pressure plates, zombies are spawned. And needless to say, the zombies can spawn more zombies, and it does not end well for me. And now I have a tombstone to recover to get my stuff. Here's the room again. When I came back, I tried to reset my spawn on the bed, and that led to this problem. You can see the pressure plate allows the zombies to keep pouring in. Every time I die, the replay mod makes everything disappear. And then when I respawn, of course, everything reappears because the mobs are still there and they go back to trying to kill me. I finally gave up and called for help. I reached out to Skelly before he left to go on vacation. And he came in and removed the pressure plate that allowed them to come in through the door. And he also removed all of the zombies. And I eventually got my stuff back. And then, of course, I went to show my son how I could get through this room because I thought I knew the path. And, of course... I didn't, and the zombies came out again, and I had to completely disassemble the whole trap to get my stuff back. And so that's why it was such giant mess where I had gone in and disassembled the entire trap and dug out the walls to get around the trap so I could press the button and kill the zombies and essentially ruined everything so that nothing would attack anybody who came here again. And that's the state it was in when Roscoe pressed the button. So the trap did not kill him and ruin his stuff or take his stuff as it had with me. Okay, we are back from that misadventure, and now it is time to talk about my desire to grow more bamboo. You see, bamboo can now be made into bamboo blocks, which you can think of as logs of bamboo. Now, my first attempt to do this was to just double the size of my current farm, 
I can do that by just building it off the back, and I can reuse the redstone. Therefore, when one side gets harvested, the other side gets harvested. So this allows me to build blocks, which are like logs, bamboo logs, which can be built into planks. But this wasn't enough. So I needed a better way. So that led to this build. The flying machine, of course, harvests the bamboo. It goes all the way down and then comes back. Harvesting bamboo both directions. So to gather all of this, I'm going to make use, or I did make use, of the allays. The allays actually gather up the bamboo, bring it over to the note block, and try to throw it on top of the note block. The fence gates, I'm sorry, trap doors prevent that. And they prevent so it all falls down into the hoppers. The hoppers then gather it up and load it into these three chests. Doesn't take that long to fill the chests. The only thing is now is I actually manually start it each time. Let's go ahead and look and see what's inside. That's full. And that one's full. And that one's full. Cool. So now what I do is I take as much as I can into my inventory make blocks of bamboo that one's full I'll just put them in here then I just keep repeating this process until I have emptied the three chests and that goes by pretty fast but for the sake of watching, let me speed this up. And we're almost done. As we finish taking these out of the chest, we can check that one, check that one, and this empties all the chests. Now we can convert these into bamboo blocks. And then once that's done, I'll convert them into bamboo planks. Just like any wood planks, these can be burned as fuel or they can be turned into other things like show you in just a second like chests so you can convert all of these to chest that's 29 chests considering the storage system I want to build I needed bamboo it's gonna take a lot of work to create all of the chests and all of the hoppers to make the storage system I have planned and that's not even considering what it's going to take to build the sorting system. That also will go with that. So, as you know, storage always takes a lot. And it'll take a lot of chests. But, that's the plan. And as you can see, with infinite bamboo comes infinite wood planks in the form of bamboo planks, which can lead to infinite chests. If you like in my content, please subscribe and click on the bell so you know when I produce more content.
Now let's move these chickens. 